Rob McDonald, class of 1987, and I'm a senior consultant with Deloitte Consulting. Uh, There's so many, and they all flow together, especially this year in the reunion year where I get to see everybody. Uh, I think the fondest memory is just the camaraderie of being at Servite, having a band of brothers that you hung out with, and from the beginning of your freshman year where you didn't know anybody or maybe have a few familiar faces from grade school, to making those new friends and those lifetime friendships, and uh, and renewing those friendships every year or every time you see somebody from your class. Oh, it was incredible. You become so close, and that's what makes Servite special. Some people poo-poo the idea of an all-boys school, but it's so important that you have a chance to just be yourself and focus on academics and just be a guy. Uh, I wouldn't trade it for the world. Um, the fact that you go through things like the academic challenges, the sports challenges, and just the personal life challenges, and your friends are there for you. The fact that you know they're there to listen or f complain with you, the hut drill. There's nothing like watching the hut drill at a football game. I mean, others have tried to imitate it, but that is such a great tradition. You know, we didn't. I didn't see it much at the stadium in last Friday, but you know, we always held our finger up as in symbolic victory. And watching the guys run out and do that was awe-inspiring. Servite's different primarily because of the reaction you get. When you go to Servite and you tell somebody that you went to Servite, they, they take a step back and they go, oh, you went to Servite. And automatically expectations change because they know that we're a, bit, a different school, that we have a different community and a different culture. The expectations, the excellence, the focus, the pride, and the faith. And so it's automatically, and I've traveled quite a bit and come across folks who are from Southern California, and they always say, oh, okay, you're from Servite, and the game changes. But that's okay, because we're used to the challenges. Service above self was always part of the culture. It was always taught here. But it has expanded so much now, and the community service, I mean, we used to, in 87, 86, we go down to the soup kitchens around Thanksgiving, but now service is evident everywhere you go and is part of the curriculum and it's part of the life at Servite, which is phenomenal because it really does expand what we started or what we were part of and every generation's getting better at exuding that Christian ideal that we're striving for. To a future student or a current student, I'd say don't shrink from the challenges. This is where you get a chance to expand what you think you're capable of because other people will see something else in you that you're capable of doing. And also, don't shrink from the challenges because of potential failure. This is the safe place to learn your, how to fail, how to learn from those failures and move on because you're not always gonna do something perfectly or right and you will stumble, but you're getting challenged here so that you're prepared to handle the defeats as well as the victories.